Hello, and welcome to the Inplug User Training. The purpose of this video is to assist you with setting up your graphics and video app. This training will cover uploading graphics onto the Inplug system and then selecting which screens they will appear on. Let's begin. Once logged in, you can access the app by going to the app drop down menu at the top of your screen and selecting graphics and video. When you access the graphics and video app for the initial time, you will be prompted to add your first graphic. And you can do so by clicking on the blue upload button in the upper right hand side of the screen. A dialog box will appear on the screen. To the left of that box, you will see the different upload options that you can select your graphics and videos from. Our supported file formats for images are JPEG and PMG. Supported formats for movies are MP4, MOV, and AVI. You can also upload PowerPoint files, and each slide will be converted into a still graphic. Once you have selected your image, click the blue Upload button on the lower right of the dialog box to upload the image. Please note, the file will be uploaded to our servers and optimized for storage on the cloud. Depending on the number and size of files you have chosen to upload, it may take several minutes for optimization process to complete. Once optimization is done, you will be presented with a list of display groups on your account. Simply check the buttons next to the groups that you would like the image to be displayed on, and it will be assigned to those screens. Be sure to click Save Changes and the image will automatically insert itself into your current rotation. You have now uploaded your first graphic to Inplug. Now that you've uploaded your first graphic, place your mouse cursor over the Edit Detail buttons of your image and click on it. A new window will open. In the upper right-hand corner of that window, click on the Schedule link. This feature will allow you to customize the times that you would like your content displayed. The Limit Days feature will allow you to choose which days of the week you want your graphics to be displayed. It will not show on days which have been unchecked. The Limit Time feature will allow you to specify time limitations. The graphics will never appear outside of the time ranges you set, and you can use the plus icon to add additional time ranges. The Schedule for Later feature will allow you to set a start and end date in future for your graphics. That way you can set things ahead of time and not have to worry about what content will be playing during your designated time slots. The Repeat option allows you to feature a graphic more or less frequently in comparison to your other graphics. By placing a number here, you can create a repeat frequency. For example, if you were to set repeat to five, then every fifth graphic will be selected, regardless of how many total slides you have. Priority Play allows you to force a graphic to appear. If you enable Priority Play to any graphic, it will take precedence on the screen and override all other content during the specified time range. If no time range is set, Priority Play will remain active until you turn it off. Once you've customized your settings, be sure to click the blue Save Changes button at the bottom of the screen. 